Uh, Tigers lose it today in a unfortunate loss. I mean, 8-3 was a final, but that was not... That could have been a lot um, less runs and probably a win for the Tigers, but, you know, they bullpen blows it, which sucks, but it doesn't really happen much, but it's going to happen eventually. Uh, Matt Manning on the mound. He's finally back. Uh, excellent game. The final stat line just doesn't do him justice, man. He was phenomenal today. He gave up two runs, but should he gave up one run, but then his own run at first scored because Jason Shreve can't pitch a freaking ball to save his life. But, uh, yeah, Manning, excellent today. Got a couple walks, but first game back since, like, April is unbelievable. Really missed him last couple months. So good to have him back in two runs. That's that's still really good. So good job, Manning. But offensively, you know, they started in the second or, yeah, the second inning. I, I don't know, second or third. And then you go back and check. But, uh, you know, a couple base hits. But, yeah, Bias starts it off. And then Miggy gets an RBI single. Nevin comes through with an RBI single. And then you strain runners. But... I feel like that's always every single game that happens. Like, we score a couple runs in this inning, like the third inning, and then we don't score until, like, the eighth or the ninth. And, I mean, you, you could win games like that, but you're not really going to win a lot of games like that. So the offense used to actually come up clutch, like, more than just once. So yesterday was a good, good job from the offense. But, I mean, two runs, three runs isn't going to do it. And then Tigers down, uh, they bring in Shreve. And I feel like every time Shreve pitches, I mean, I feel like every, yeah, every time he pitches, he gives up a run. And he only throws three batters, which, how can you give up a run if you only pitch to three batters? How bad are you, man? He's the only guy that I do not like in the bullpen. And then Vest got hurt, so he's not going anywhere. But, man, Shreve just, every single time, man, this guy... Every single time he gets up a run, man. Why can't you be like Foley or Lang, dude? Or everybody else in the bullpen are actually pretty good. <sighs> man, he blows, man. That I th Yeah. He gives up the two runs. And then in the eighth inning, Spencer Torkelson finally comes through. After being three for 40 his last at couple at-bats. Last 43 at-bats. He hits a home run. Laser beam. to home run. And then, uh, yeah home run and with two outs just a two out rally for the blue uh blue jays for the rangers i mean that stinks but this is a good team um of course the twins lost again man they are just not a very good team <laughs> what is that but we really have a chance of the division but why am i talking like that when the team can't can only score three runs on average oh that's if they're doing good but the bullpen in the eighth, Brendan White gave up a home run and two outs. And then they just kept on getting, they base it, base it, double. I don't, I feel like Kerry Carpenter could have made that play, but that sucks though. And they just poured on. But even if he makes that catch, I don't think we win this game. I mean, you have Javi Baez, Jonathan Scope, and Miguel Cabrera in the ninth. I don't think you're going to score runs, so... You could say that we lost because of Carpenter, but I don't think that. No, you're crazy if you think that. You're crazy if you think the Tigers were going to score a run with those three hitters. I mean, they're, they're not. They're not. But uh, player of the game, we'll give it a Manning. I think we'll give it a Manning. Thinking, yeah, who else could it be? Yeah, Matt Manning. Nobody else really stepped up. Torkelson maybe, but nah. Well, yeah, we'll give it a Matt Manning. At least we uh, won one game. Hopefully we can win the series in the next two games, but yep, see you tomorrow. Manning, player of the game.